What's going on guys? Welcome back to Golden Sun and man, I wish that if you had picked up a Wii U they would have told you that it was gonna get disgustingly dirty because the gamepad gets really gross. Anyway, we were in, uh, I want to say Bilabin and we were about to speak with Mr. I want to McCoy, there you go. Mr. McCoy. I do however want to steal one of Mr. McCoy's nuts. <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. Alright, so is this, uh... The lumbar I ordered from Kalima disappeared after the... Incident. I like how he paused right before that word. Alright. Have you seen the barricade we built on the road to Kalima? No, I did not. It's off to the east if you want to see it. It was a rush job, so I had to take some shortcuts. Alright. Guess the, the barricade probably isn't that great. It was this purple-haired lady. Are you telling me that I'm responsible for this? Yes. <laughs> I don't know who you are, but yes you are. Sure, I had them cut the tree down so I could build my palace. But if anyone is a victim, it's me. I've been waiting for my palace for months. Well, that is rough. No, you're not. That curse of the tree spirit is a foolish old superstition. I just want to live in a big palace. Well, that is as reasonable as it gets. She just wants to live in a big palace. Well's dried up, all right. We can not check that, let's talk to these dudes. The Lord will only meet with brave and mighty warriors. You don't seem the type, think you're up to it? Yes, look at me, man. Hmm, I see, you seem pretty confident. What do you say, they look a little young to get involved in this ugly mess. No, just let me go in. Nobody else seems up to the challenge though, what do we have to lose? Yeah, there you go, well your jobs, for one, is what you have to lose, maybe your head if things really, you know, start getting rough. But thank you. So this is McCoy's place. I always believe that the old train Kalima Forest should be protected. Well, you should have mentioned that earlier to the right people. And we would have been a, a lot better off. Alright, oh, what is up with that? Look at you, a smoke bomb. Okay, I'm sure that'll maybe come in handy at some point. Although usually when I play RPGs, I forget all about the items and I just hoard them. And then I use them in like the last boss fight, if I even use them at all. Just, I like to be sparing with my items. Alright, we have a basement here. Oh, hello. What do you think? These are Bilbin's great treasures. Whoever ends the curse can claim these as his own. We are ending that curse. I see six treasure chests, yup. I need those in my life. Alright. So, let's check this side now. Just to see if there's anything we might be... Oh, look at you. Hmm, it seems the curse of the tree has not yet come to Billman. Why are you guarding this, t this tiny little room with absolutely nothing in it? Just a little dumb... Oh, hey. Oh, are you willing to go to Kalima Forest? Sure, I'll go there. I forget how many people look Lord McCoy has hired to end the curse. And yet, not a single warrior has returned. Make sure you don't offend Lord McCoy. Why? What? What's he gonna do about it? I'm gonna do any, everything and add anything in my power to offend this guy. You can see Kalima pretty well from here. On sunny days, Lord McCoy comes here to admire the view. Okay. That's one reason to build a palace, I suppose. Nothing in there, just an old man. Okay, and there's one last part that we haven't checked, which is this stair stairwell case. Oh, hi there. This is Lady McCoy's room, so don't touch anything. Oh, I won't. I won't. The lady was renowned far and wide for her beauty. That's why my lord is so anxious to please her, regardless of cost. Okay. Oh, someday I want to sleep in a silk nightgown like this. Let me see that. Oh, I guess I'm not allowed to steal. Excuse me, lady. Excuse me. I like how you can actually push people out of the way. That is incredibly rude, and I like it. So, are you telling me that these p people actually have separate rooms? That's a little weird. Sheet of paper titled, Sweetie's Gifts. It's the list of gifts Lord McCoy has bought his wife. It's pretty long. So, basically, she's just a really spoiled person. And only because she used to be really pretty. Okay. If you want to see Lord McCoy, follow the red carpet. Well, I can do that for sure. Oh, well, this is him, I guess. 
the man himself. What's happening? What's the matter then? Sir, some new warriors have just arrived in the palace. New warriors, you say? You cheeky... Oh. We've sent many a man into Kalima Forest, but not a one has returned. These warriors, did you get a look, good look at them? I don't really know what this accent is. I have no idea. Come closer, laddie. I think it's pretty much spot on. Hey, are these the ones you were talking about, mate? They're but children. Well, you have a mustache. And you expect me to believe you could save Kalima? Yeah, we can do it. Hmm, well, I grant you a brave lot. Wait, what What accent is that? This will key, this key will get you past the better kids to the east. Well, thank you. Even with the key, such wee lads as yourselves never reach Kalima. What is he? He's making fun of us, he's calling us children. That's just irritating, don't you think, Isaac? Yes, it is. Well, don't let him get to you. We'll just have to prove we can handle this job, whatever it is. So, you've decided to accept our little job. Yes, I have. I'm doing it. Just give me that key. Hey, Ivan, you don't look too enthusiastic. He's a little sad. That curse can turn a man into a tree. You think we stand a chance? Yes, of course we do. Why would you even ask? Yeah, there we go. Garrett agrees with me. You know we do, right, Isaac? Yeah, we do. Come on, Ivan. Well, if Isaac's going, I guess I'm in too. Well, don't just go following Isaac. At least we all agree on something. Oh, man. Just give me that key so I can get to work. What troubles you, my lord? They seem willing enough. They call themselves warriors, but they're not but we children. Am I going to have to keep doing this accent for the whole... How many, how many lines is this guy going to say? Aye, these are desperate times, but I can't send such wee lads to their doom. Whoa, he just took the key back. Why would you do that? We can't give up hope on our other champions. Okay, but what about us? Yeah, what are we supposed to do, man? We can't send you into certain doom. Well, come on. What if we said that we were going east anyway? You can go once things have settled down. Well, that means you're not going to let us go? Ugh, it's for your own good, lad. Oh, come on, man. Just let us go. We're men. I didn't even want to talk about it anymore. Captain! Oh, well, okay then. This guy doesn't look like a captain. We should leave. Uh, you should leave, man. Alright. So, we spoke with the guy. Your name was Isaac? I'm sorry you were rejected. It's okay. I never ever expected anything like this to happen to Bilibin. Will you promise me you won't go to Kalima? Nope, can't do that. You are persistent, aren't you? That barricade, you may not need a key. Oops, I shouldn't have said anything. Well, I'm gonna go now. Well, okay, see you, Captain. So that basically is in line with what the builder up there said earlier that he had to do some lazy stuff with the barricade and not actually do a great job on it. So what we're going to do is we will be checking in at the end, taking a sweet room for uh, 21 coins a stay. And then, oh, nope, didn't mean to do that. Sorry about that. And then tomorrow we will check out this barricade. And when I say tomorrow, I mean right now. I don't mean actually tomorrow, because that I'm not going to wait for this. No, -uh, we're going to go right there. Right now, actually. Wait a minute, didn't people... Oh, well, didn't mean to do that. Okay, didn't people say that this... Uh, yes. That this tree used to be a person? Maybe we can read its mind. Help me, somebody. I'm stuck in a tree. All right. So we're going east. We're gonna go find this barricade and break it. Oh, what is that? That is a lot of enemies. All right. Pretty sure that um, quake doesn't really work all that well. Let's go with something like that. 
should work, I think. There we go, Rhett is dead. And then some fire as well. Dead, dead, and dead. That worked out pretty well, I'd say. How much experience do we need anyway? Ooh, we are getting there, okay. So I'm guessing this is the barricade. Billman Barricade. All right. This area is off limits to all those without a permit. Lord McCoy. Man, how are we gonna get through this? This area is all closed up, or is it? Look at that, did you see that? Boom, there you go. This is the laziest barricade ever constructed by a human being. <laughs> There's th <laughs> tree, trees, tree. There's three trees. <laughs> They're just stacked on top of each other. They're so heavy. And I don't believe we can actually read more than, yeah, only the bottom ones, mind we can read here. All right, so we got through the barricades extremely easy. That was just a shoddy job by, uh, Lord McCoy's employees. Uh, let's go ahead and take you, and then I want you to do Whirlwind, because we haven't seen that yet. Look at that. It's actually not that amazing, but hey, it's an attack. Let's just see if we can finish this job. So Ray only costs one extra PP, and it does way more damage. And there you go. Isaac level 6, Master to Squire's Spire. That's pretty cool. We are going to get to look at that. I'm pretty sure that only targets one actual enemy. Yes, it does. Attack with Earth and Spire. Let's see, is there anything this way? Like I said, usually it's nothing, but sometimes it is worth checking out. And then also we get to do some sweet synergy. I really just want to see Spire. Boom! I like that. Oh, that's actually really strong as well. Sweet. So now we have that, which is great. One damage, really, that is pathetic. Okay, I guess a bunch of thingies and th stuff. Isaac checked on the ground. Turtle boots. See, I know that sometimes there is something. Oh, look at that. This is not what I had in mind when I said uh, that. There's some ray. That should help a little bit. Oh man, this rat is really gonna be a problem, isn't it? Oh, it's defending, that's why, okay. Three damage, 24, seven, well, there you go. Pretty sure that uh, Ivan is gonna be pretty close to leveling up. Uh, so let's take a look at these boots. Boosts defense and decreases agility. So they would be, at least arguably, they would be best for someone that has little agility, such as our buddy Garrett here. So I'm gonna go ahead and actually pass that on to him. There you go, Garrett. Yep, equip it. Whoa, that is actually a pretty small boost in defense, but... Uh, did it replace anything? What's happening right now? I'm pretty sure it should have replaced... something. Oh, actually, that's very little defense, I just noticed. Oh, whatever. It'll do for Garrett for now, and then we'll just sell him later get some cash and then we should be okay oh look at that critical hit are you kidding me that i cannot believe okay let's just keep at it There's nothing else we can do really critical hit that's good and we're done garrett is now level six guard master the guards flare wall all right so i'm pretty sure this is the first siren g we're seeing that's actually just an improved version of another... Actually, I guess Quake and Earthquake are sort of the same principle with, you know, you start off with a pretty simple synergy, you get a bit of an upgrade. Pretty cool. I like it. Now next, we are... Look at that. There's a little forest right here. This is probably what we're... Oh. All right, we got some rats. Let's go deal with these stinking rats. Boom. Are they defending again? I think, yep, that rat was definitely defending. 11 damage. Let's just finish that one off, please. There we go. 6 damage. Good. 34 coins. I'm getting a lot of coins here. All right, so this is the forest we're looking for. And we got a nice little cutscene. Wait, are those things butterflies on the trees and stuff? What's the matter, Ivan? That's sparkly stuff on the ground. 
What is it? Well, they're not but butterflies, I guess that's, and you know, that answers my question there. Oh, what's happening right now? Oh. Ah, uh, what's, what's happening? My mind, someone is attacking my... Boom, boom, boom. Uh-oh, that's not good, is it? Stuff is falling. Something's falling from the sky. Yep, it's sparkling. Could this be what turned those people into... Oh, man. We've got to get out of here. Uh-oh. I can't. I can't move. What is that? 